This is a short series on being Christian and child-free. Note, this is not a space to bash parents, children, or those who cannot or do not have children for whatever reason. This series is mainly for other child-free by choice Christians who may be facing pressure by their congregation, religious leaders, or those in their lives to have children and are being told they have to because it's God's will. I want to let my other child-free by choice Christians know there's nothing wrong with their decision. So first question, can you be child-free by choice and Christian? Absolutely, a thousand percent yes. Being a Christian and being child-free by choice is not a contradiction, just like being a Christian and having children is not a contradiction. Whether or not people have children is something between God, those going to raise and care for the children, and a medical doctor if necessary. And yet it amazes me how many forms of Christianity pressure their adherents to have children. Listen, I believe in supporting kids and their parents. I avoid parts of the internet that dehumanize children or want to lock children into their houses. Absolutely not. Children have the right to be uh, to occupy public spaces. I think kids are adorable, especially babies. But that doesn't change the fact that I don't want to personally have children. Some Christians assert that having children is God's purpose for every single person, especially women. But saying God wants every person to have children is like saying God wants every person to be, I don't know, a medical surgeon. Trust me, you don't want me performing any type of surgery. I believe God gives each of us unique desires, hopes, and skills, and dreams, and that we honor God by trying to embrace who we are without trying to conform to other people's expectations for us. For some people, embracing their desires and hopes means having children. For me, it means acknowledging the reality that parenthood is not for me. I also believe in creating a society where we can support and empower people to make the right decisions for themselves. I believe in supporting parents by providing free and low-cost daycare, providing maternity and paternity leave, universal health care, etc. No one, including parents, should have to worry about how they're going to keep a roof over their heads and food on the table. And no one should be pressured or forced into having children. Both parents and those without children can and should support each other in creating a more just and equitable world.